Yo, what's up guys? It's me, Pink Engineer here. Welcome back to another video. As you can see, we are showcasing off this character today. And as long with another, we have the whistle, which is actually pretty cool. This is a really old whistle. And this just goes on right back there like that. And then um, we have the head turn. The hands, which are two separate two separate valves that control these, which is pretty cool. Same with this one. Same with the head lean and the jaw. So everything moves. So if I wanted this one to move and then this one to move after, I can. Or if I want this one to lift up and then wait a few seconds and then this one to lift up. That's how I program it. It works pretty cool. Um, we got the stand, which needs to go. Um, so once I build the crate for it, that's where that's gonna go. And then we have this character here. There's the head, which if you aren't following my Instagram, it's right there. If you wanna go follow it. I post a lot of stuff before I post on here. I know it's been two months, but yeah. Now the difference between these and that head is this one doesn't go on by a bolt. This one goes on. It's actually was made around this and permanently put in this with screws and stuff. So pretty neat. And this one is plaster, as this one is rubber. And yeah, a lot of things are a bit different with these two characters, as this jaw was just cut off the back of his head, as this one didn't, we sculpted it without back head and made the jaw hand sculpted. And I see how this jaw is all hand sculpted. That's exactly how that guy's head's gonna be all done. It's gonna have no fur, it's gonna be hand sculpted, but it's gonna be way better than this. We're gonna use sculpt tools and I'm gonna sculpt it really good. And I'm gonna paint it with an airbrush. And yeah, so thanks for watching guys.